I secretly expanded my office in different cafes using dex mode on my S25 Ultra. Each morning, I would pick a mechanical keyboard, grab my monitor and phone, and head out to a new coffee shop to set up my office. Boring, fun, boring. I'll be trying to push dex to its limits to see how productive I could actually be with it. A new day, a new keyboard. Today, I feel like taking this one. If you've never heard of Dex Mode before, it's basically having the ability to use your Samsung device and turn it into like a Chromebook. You can like connect it wirelessly to a TV. You can connect it wired into a, any monitor. So let's head over to a cafe and I'll show you how I set the thing up using a portable monitor. All right. This is called a lap dock. This was made specifically for dex mode. And you can just swivel it over like this. Just pull down on the uh, quick settings. So I'm just gonna tap on dex. Start now. Boom. You can turn this into a trackpad. So now it's a trackpad. So my I can control the mouse, I can do multitask gestures. Pretty cool. There's only one problem. Bringing this lap dock shell is the same as bringing a MacBook Air. Yet, the MacBook Air can actually do more than Dex Mode. So, in order to get rid of this clamshell thing and stop everyone from saying, hey, just use a laptop, I reached out to my friends at Xreal. Hello, Xreal. I would like to use your latest and greatest glasses. Within a few hours, they replied with, would you mind sending me the address and phone number again? Let's go! We are unboxing this X-Roll. <laughs> <laughs> what? I thought it was a phone. It's a sunglass. On. And I took it to my new modern office on my face to my next coffee shop. Another morning. Another bloody cafe. I started the deck session with a 100 inch Instagram doom scroll. Then I continued the doom scroll on X. Everything just looks so good at 100 inches. I then wrote some scripts and edited some photos for socials. Then watched my unreleased YouTube video whilst It'll having breakfast. Pasta. Do I look like a total nut job? Yes, but I don't care because I am looking at a 100 inch Instagram. These new glasses have the anchor feature built in so I can lock my Dex monitor in place like the Apple Vision Pro and start smashing out work in privacy on this epic mechanical keyboard. And the reason why I chose a different keyboard every morning was to just, you know, spice it up, get me excited to do admin work in the morning. Bro, I can't believe I just did like a proper two hour session using just my phone. That is, that is madness. Yeah, that was good dude. Cheers bro. Because I'm forcing myself to do admin work at cafes every day with dex mode, I'm pumped. I get, I'm pumped to, to get up and go to a new cafe and just try Dex mode in like a new setting. It's freaking awesome. This is life right here. <laughs> I literally just wrote the script for the SSD over here because I am absolutely enjoying this super thin. Look at, look at this. Look how thin it is. I bought my own one terabyte NVMe storage for just 59 bucks on Amazon. And it took me like 15 seconds to install. This thing has the USB-C cable built in. Probably the most revolutionary thing that's happened to SSDs. Slap it on the back of the phone with MagSafe and off you go. This is changing my life, especially for when I'm on the go. I've been actually using this to vlog a lot more. I'll leave a link below the like button. Go check it out. It does help the channel by just even checking it out. All right, let's head over to another office.
I was chilling at a cafe and an older dude came up to me asking what I was doing. So I decided to blow his mind with dex mode. Do you oh, see? Oh wow, yeah. I see the phone, yeah. Do you see? No, no, you can look oh. anywhere you want. Do you see the big screen? I see the big screen here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, you, so you can watch movies on there. Oh, right, yeah, yeah. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah, come on. Shit, yeah, amazing. Shit. <laughs> Shit. Yeah. Excuse me, what are you doing? I'm um, just getting some work done, mate. Oh, yeah, what's up with it? I'm setting up the office at cafes and public places, right? Oh, very nice. Very yeah. nice. The next day, I was just gaming on a bench and this random kid came to try gaming with 100 inch monitor in the air. Then the lady beside me asked if she could try as well. You wanna have a look? Yeah. yeah. It was so good to see people genuinely interested in tech. Human beings. I've got Dex set up, okay, just shoved it into my main monitor. Let's actually test the limits. The first thing you wanna do, uh, download Multistar and then tap on this I love Samsung button and run many apps at the same time. Flick that on. So let's actually go wild and see if I can blow up this phone. All right, let's open all my social media stuff. In terms of refresh rate, this is definitely 60 refresh rate. It's definitely not 120 hertz, okay? Gemini's, let's open like my contacts, let's open my Spotify, let's open my YouTube music. Let's open my, let's read the Bible. You know what, let's read two Bibles. You know, let's go crazy, mate. Let's go open the, ooh, am I feeling lag? No, nah, not really. Let's open post office. Let's open Bankstown Sports. Let's do some shopping. Let's do some, I don't know. There might be some whack job that needs to do all this. Do you know what I mean? And this video is for you, mate. Open some calendar. Let's do some Disney Plus. Why not? Let's shop at some, some of that. Let's, um, Open the Charge Fox app. Let's open the Black Magic Camera app. Oh, I saw something close. I think I saw the limitation. Holy cow. Okay, guys. <laughs> Look at the tabs. It's gone wild. The people at Samsung did not think that people will open over one, two. They didn't think we'll open more than 30 apps. Let's see if I can open one more thing and see what happens. GPT. Oh, it's still opening. Oh. Can't show 20 more apps on the screen at the same time. Okay. Now, is it lagging? No, it's actually not. Dude, this is insane. Honey, yeah. can I just show you something? Yeah. I've got 20 apps open. <laughs> can your iPhone do this? That's my question. iPhone? Can't do that. Yeah, your phone can't do this. I've got 20 apps open on the screen at the same That's time. Your laptop. And is it lagging? It's not my laptop, it's my phone. This is Dex. This is Samsung. Look, if I open Instagram. Can you, you this is this is my phone. Huh? What should you Yeah. So if you plug my iPhone, my iPhone. No, you that. can't do this. No, you can't. Oh. It's called Samsung Dex. Now touch the phone. This has been on for a while. Is this super hot or not? It's a bit warm, but it's not like, super it's not warm. super duper, which is crazy. Uh, Whilst I've got all this crap open, let's see, can I do Canva? Is this your phone? This is my phone. And currently I've got Canva open. Is oh. it lagging? No. Not really. Dude. Oh. Oh. This is, I feel like this is my laptop right now. Cause I've got mouse, I can right click, look at that. This is mad. Let's go and do Figma. I did Figma last year. It worked. It was a bit awkward, like keyboard shortcuts, like holding space bar didn't work. Dude! So can I export? Export. It's the team over at Figma. It's a team over at Canva that's making it very responsive so that idiots like me using Dex mode can actually get proper Figma work done. Now, if you're a designer and you got this phone with the S Pen, this is a no brainer. Jono, if you're watching this, get the S25 Ultra or the fold, the next fold, whatever that is. My mate, Jono, like he'll come to the meetings 
And his laptop, his MacBook Pro is like, I don't know what it is, but it's, it's so crap, he'd rather use his iPad or his phone. This thing is faster than both his iPad and his phone and his laptop. Just look at the bottom. I've got 6 million apps still open. It's all working. When I open app, it doesn't like refresh. It's like, it's ready to go. Nothing, everything is still stored in RAM. Here we go. And let me talk about this. Oh, whoa. Here's the thing. CapCut treated my mouse like a finger. LumaFusion is treating the mouse like a mouse. Exporting. So what I'm going to do is let's use our SSD. Click and drag. Drop it into here. Boom. Eject the drive. Unmount. And that's it. I take this bad boy out. I chuck it into my Mac. Put it in Premiere. Bob's your uncle. Whoa! My hair looks absolutely ridiculous. Let me, let me just fix that real quick. Bah! Whoa! Yeah! But yeah, that, that's nice. I'm impressed and I think Dex Mode is one of the selling points. Just want to let everyone know this channel is more than just a tech channel. Our family has a mission. Two years ago we went to Bangladesh and we produced a documentary for free so that we can keep the schools open in the slums. And last year, wife and I went to Mongolia and we filmed two documentaries there. And it's all thanks to you guys watching the video, subscribing, liking, commenting. So I just want to say thank you and just a reminder that that is what drives us. I am in grave danger this morning. I didn't have enough coffee beans. I am absolutely screwed. I quickly jumped on my deck setup to grab my favorite beans. Turns out there was a shipping fee. $10 shipping fee, which is something I don't want to pay. So I drove one hour to the coffee roasters to save my 10 bucks. Finally here. These door handles. How cool is that? So I'm at a coffee roaster here and this guy's kept this one for five years. You gotta check out the condition of this. This is insane. Hang on. Ooh, on. look at that. This is it. insane. But hey, it's still working. If I come back here two years later and the guy's still rocking an S20, I will give him a new phone. Check out BM Coffee. They're not sponsoring this video, but I absolutely not just love their coffee, but their service as well. They're just awesome human beings. I found this cute village on the way back and popped into a cafe to do some more admin work on Dex. People around me couldn't help but ask, what the F are you doing, bro? Yeah, I've never seen I've got a hundred inch screen right here. Yeah, that's what I yeah. I've plugged it into this, this phone yeah. and this phone turns the phone into like a computer. It's amazing. You know, this is all cool, but it honestly feels like a very, very good gimmick. I just don't see why anyone should live like this. There's only like three scenarios I could think of that could justify Dex. Scenario one, your computer blows up and you need something temporarily to get work done. Scenario two, you overspent on your Galaxy flagship phone and now you can't afford a laptop. Dude, I don't think I can buy a laptop. Scenario three, you're just bored out of your ass. And that's the scenario that I fall into. It is a super niche feature that I happen to be enjoying, but 99.9% .9 of users, they both, most people don't even know they can do this with their phone, by the way. For me personally, the novelty of using these AR glasses. A mechanical keyboard is the thing that kind of excites me about it, pumps me up and makes me want to use it, right? But without this novelty, I don't know. If you're going to bring glasses, a mechanical keyboard, just bring a tablet. I think the only very niche time I was like, this is cool and this is not as convenient to do with a laptop was when I was writing a script in the plane on Dex mode with my glasses in privacy. And I had some random person sitting next to me looking at me like I was from the future. That was the only time where I was like, dude, this is cool. Like, this is actually like, dude, every plane ride, I want to do this. 
Good morning, human beings. I'm actually going to catch a plane. So I was testing this guy, but because I need the battery, I'm going to take my beautiful jet black and check this out. And this is a keyboard that is similar size. How cool is that? <laughs> you don't understand how excited I got when I got a job booked in where I can fly. <laughs> I think I'm the only human being on planet Earth that used Dex mode to order an Uber. <laughs> my Uber's here. Bye-bye. <laughs> my wife's sending me off to my new office. All right, bye-bye. I grabbed my heavy ass Pelican case, jumped in the Uber, and headed straight to the airport. I always wanted to know what it looked like under the security scanning thing. Couldn't see Jack. So my office today is the Sydney airport. So check it out. I'll be stationing my office space here. Oh man, with my glasses on and everything, it's gonna be crazy. Oh man. <laughs> all, these, all these peasants using their laptops. Oh, I didn't bring the glasses. Dude, I can't believe I forgot my glasses. And I don't have any more flights booked in until... I actually don't have any more flights booked in, which means this video is going to go without me making the airport my office. I'm so sorry guys, that was just... Oh. I jumped on the plane, took out my laptop between two huge men, and I just couldn't deal. On the flight back, I pulled out my mini keyboard and just imagined myself using Dex and how awesome that would have been. So is it worth going out and buying these glasses and a mechanical keyboard? to use Dex mode? Absolutely not. Like, do not do that. I will link it in the description. And if you're crazy, go and get it so I can get some commission. But I don't recommend it. Like, this is not something that you should get to use for Dex mode. But yeah, it's one of those awkward features where it's like, I'd rather have it. This is Dex mode. By using TeamViewer, I can be anywhere in the world as long as my Mac is on. I got Mac OS. Oh my goodness. Um, let me open Premiere. I can do Photoshop. Dude! If I had to choose between Dex mode or the Bluetooth in my pen, I'll probably pick the Bluetooth in my pen. Office? What, what top of office? No, <laughs> you're actually what pretty good. Office? You're actually pretty good. <laughs> 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 After all questions, huh? <laughs> yeah, uh, Check out this guy's business, brother. You're the what best. is it? Sydney Metro Me Me Plumbing. Me Plumbers. Best plumbers in town. 